In this tutorial we're going to go over how to install TrueCrypt onto a PC. I would recommend at this time getting version 7.1a from TrueCrypt's website. So we'll just go there to TrueCrypt.org and the first thing we're going to do is go to the download section. And on the download section you come down a little bit and you'll see that there's a version for Windows 7, Vista, XP and 2000. So that's the one that we're going to get. So we click on download. We'll save this file. As before, we'll save it into our downloads folder. This should come in pretty quick because TrueCrypt is not that big. Alright, so I'm just going to right click here. I'm going to open it right from there. Turn off Always Ask before opening this file. I'm going to run. I'm going to accept the terms. Next, I'm going to install. You have an option to run TrueCrypt Portable as well. This is what the extract option is here. So you can visit TrueCrypt to get a little more information on doing that. Okay, we want to install for all users. I'm going to add it to the start menu. I don't want it on the desktop. I'm going to associate the TC file extension with TrueCrypt. That way all files that end in the TC extension on the computer will automatically open up with TrueCrypt if I double click on it. And I don't need a system restore point in this at, in this case, although I would recommend you leave it on in your system. All right, TrueCrypt is successfully installed. If you want to go give them a donation, they're well worth it. Okay, let's finish here. No, we don't want to read the tutorial right now. And so, with that, we have TrueCrypt installed. All right, let's see if we can bring TrueCrypt up here to have a look at it. And here's the TrueCrypt interface, so we're all done.